breaking Disneyland news. Avatar is coming to Disneyland. During today's earnings call, Disney CEO... I am so tempted to do this entire video response with this filter, but I won't. <laughs> okay, okay, that's better. <laughs> so hopefully, like, with the day having passed, this is all sunk in, that, that this is not Pandora. I, I need... I need to know that you know that this isn't Pandora, okay? Note that Iger said an avatar experience, not that they're bringing Pandora to Disneyland. There's literally no room for that. Even if they gutted all of tomorrow. Well, if they got all of tomorrow, but we don't want that. I think the use of the word experience is key here. And why is that, Samantha? I I'm gonna tell you. Because there's already an avatar experience that's literally using that phrasing, like avatar the experience in Singapore. It's like got walkthroughs, interactive like things you can play with, and I can see this happening. It would be great if it went into Launch Bay. Completely retool Launch Bay, put avatar the experience in there, chef's kiss. Another option I can see happening is them using the theater in Tomorrowland and doing like a 3D show in there. That's like an avatar experience that can kind of mimic the flight of passage vibe, especially if they can do like a minions ride thing where your seat moves with it. That's the closest thing we can get to flight of passage, which honestly I think is like one of the most overrated rides at Disney, but like that's a topic for another day. I don't know. What do you think? It, it, it's just not Pandora. Okay.